After a few days exploring beautiful Tehran, the capital city of Iran, it was now time for me to head south to explore more areas of this beautiful country. Good morning everybody from beautiful Tehran. Today I'm leaving the city and heading south to Om. This city apparently is beautiful and there's a lot to see so let's jump in the car and head there now. Okay, everybody, we just arrived in Om. I've just met Said. Can you explain a little bit about the significance of this city here in Iran? Hello. Uh, the, we are actually located in, a, uh, in the second holiest uh, city of, of Iran, that is Om. Significance is because of the burial of uh, one of the greatest uh, Shiite and Muslim personalities here in, the, in this holy city. Om is a city just a few hours south of Tehran and is said to be the second holiest city in the whole of Iran. Many, many students come here from over 120 countries to study Islam right here. We are now getting close to the shrine of uh, Lady Fatima Masuma. Uh, Lady Fatima Masuma was the uh, daughter of our, uh, the Shiite uh, Imam, Imam Musa Kazim, the seventh Imam uh, of the Shiites and uh, also the sister of Imam Rida. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, he, as you know, he, he is buried in the Mashhad, yes. city of Iran. Uh, and uh, the, as I told you, the significance of this city is because of uh, the existence of this lady in this uh, city. <laughs> I've just made it inside the shrine of Lady Fatima Masuma. As you can see, pretty spectacular. The decoration inside of here is just splendid. Wow. It's an honor to be in here. Okay, so inside of this beautiful shrine complex are three courtyards. This one, the first one, and the largest is the mirror courtyard. As you can see where it gets its name from, this beautiful mirrored gateway. Wow, it's so, so incredible. The colors, the detail in all of this courtyard is mind-blowing. Now we are in the courtyard of Azam Mosque and uh, this mosque was built around 60 years ago but the, by the direct order of Ayatollah Burujardi, late uh, Ayatollah Burujardi who was the greatest scholar uh, of the time. So as I had beautifully explained, this is the Assad Mosque. In Farsi, it's Assad, in English it means the Great Mosque. Inside, the highest level of scholars teach under this golden dome and all of the inside is interconnected to all of the other areas inside this huge shrine complex, making this area phenomenally large. Hundreds of thousands probably can fit inside. Wow, the sun is setting just behind here. You can see the beautiful turquoise colors. Wow. I'm really lost for words, it's so beautiful. I 
honestly can't quite believe the level of detail in every single area of this shrine. This is huge. You can see all of the beautiful detailed tiles. Wow, seven different colors inside this one. All handmade. And you can see the grandeur. I don't think I've ever seen anything this intricately beautiful in my entire trips around the world. with their own eyes they all the confusion will go away they discover the truth I just left the inside of the shrine. Scenes very similar to what I saw in Kabbalah on both occasions. Many people crying so emotional as they kiss and weep over the shrine. Many people praying inside. A very emotional and raw experience, especially as a foreign tourist, whether you're religious or not. You can see all the lights are coming on. This complex has to be one of the most beautiful I've ever seen. Om so far is an incredibly beautiful city and uh, this is only my third day here in Iran and I'm overwhelmed by the beauty, the kindness of the people and everything else in between. Wow. Okay, my time at this beautiful shrine is over. You can see the sun has gone down, all of the lights are on. This is one of the most special places I've ever seen in my whole life. Wow. The complexity, the beauty, and everything else inside is phenomenal. I'm really lost for words. Wow. Good morning everybody from beautiful Om here in Iran. Today I'm sadly leaving but I'm heading south to explore more of this beautiful country. Today I'm heading to Kashan. I highly recommend all tourists to come here, all foreign tourists to come and experience this amazing culture here in the city. One of the most special places I've ever been. So let's jump in the car and let's head south to discover more of this beautiful Iranian culture.